All right, Jermaine, first let's talk about last weekend, Saturday night, clock winding down. You're going up to the layup. What's going through your mind? Was there a play set, or was it just you create and see what happens? Um, when the clock's going down, coach runs a play called flat for me to get the ball and everybody to clear out. So I just did a real strong move, went to the basket, and finished strong. How did it feel to be able to hit that shot and get the win for the team? It felt, it felt good because we were down the whole game, so it felt good for us to fight back and become a unit as a team and make it a W. Coming back this week, getting to play two games at home, what's it like to uh, get back at home and what have y'all been working on to get ready for this week? Uh, we were working on rebounding and playing defense, getting through, through the screens, fighting hard. I really have a good intensity on defense. That's really what we need to um, get easy basketball and transition. That's really it. With a lot of new teammates coming into the program, have y'all finally started to come together as a team and kind of realize if so, know where the passes are going to be and playing with each other? Yeah, we um, everybody's um, buying into the offense, you know, so that's real good. Everybody, everybody's unselfish, so we have a selfish team. Everybody can pass the ball. Everybody, nobody cares who, who gets the most shots. So it's a good offense, and we all just work hard. Always want to win and help uh, put Angelo stay on the map. What are you looking forward to see from uh, Arlington Baptist tomorrow night? Um, probably a lot of ball pressure. You know, we're trying to help us stop our guards. You know, we got good guards. They start to stop our concentration and shooting. We got a sharp shooter on, on the side with Joey, so they're gonna have to really play defense. Okay, thanks for that. All right, and you talk about Saturday being down for the majority of the game and then being able to come back and win. What it did for your guys' confidence and for the team as a whole? Uh, Saturday the game was a tough one. We was down, I would say, majority of the game. Uh, our coaches told him in the halftime, we told him to show him some toughness. You know, we were out there, the rebound we repeated for the rest of the 20 minutes of the half. So when we came back, it was like, it was like we, something we, we strive for, we fought for. You know, we could have gave up easily, but it felt good to repeat and come back and pull a win out there. Getting to come back home, play two games this week. What have you been working on to get better this week? Uh, getting through screens, down screening. Uh, rebounding the uh, ball well, taking care of the ball more, and uh, not not and not our main the ball. You know, not not let them catch it as easy as we was in uh, Friday night game against St. Mary's. Getting to play with the team as a whole, having a brand new cast of teammates, is that camaraderie and cohesion as a team starting to come together now? Yes, yes, we say that the team is actually starting to come coming up good. You know, it was like I say we complement each other. You know, we have people who drive, then we had guys that. Once you collapse from the drivers, you had the shooters. So I think we all come together and make a good team, a good perfect team. What are you expecting out of Arlington Badgers tomorrow night? A uh, big win, a big, a big W. You know, uh, we go out here face them, just take care of business, get the W, bring it home for the school. Right. Thanks, Nick. Thank Appreciate you. it, man.